So I am excited because I feel like I always get to find the best innovative styles to share with you all on my channel. So if you are looking for the best wigs, this is the channel. Today's wig is the new fitted cap 13 by 6 lace wig. Now you know over here we love our glueless wigs so if you are looking to add another one to your wig collection this is it. We're going to jump into all the details. Stay tuned and let's get into it. Today's wig comes from Bonnie Hair. This wig here is their fitted 13 by 6 cap you are looking for a cap that's going to fit so as you can see the cap construction comes with the ear tab area so that you can wear glueless their built-in straps so you can use the ones in the back or you can use the ones here comes with the comb here so that the back of the nape area won't flap around you can just insert it to give you more security and it also has combs inside the cap that you can use. The lace is Swiss lace and Swiss lace will blend pretty good and it does come with a pre-plucked hairline and this is a color number two. I'm going to take the even tinted lace and medium brown. Now if you feel like the medium brown is too orange they definitely have more colors. Here is the medium beige and this one is a little bit lighter. It doesn't have any orange tones to it at all. I usually mix both. I'm just going to spray this around the knots. Touch it with a little bit of this. Now that one is lighter so you may need to clean the hair. Now when cutting the ear tab area there is um, a piece here so you don't want to make, make a mistake and cut that so just make sure you cut around it. That piece is to help lay the ear, ear area down without it flapping if you're going glueless. We'll bend it, we'll bend it, do that and just lay it down. And do the same thing with this side. Cut away this ear tab area without cutting off that piece. And we're going to get rid of this extra lace. Now the tab area, all you have to do is bend it so it can lay down this area, which works really good, by the way. All right, so today we're going to do a side part. And as you can see, the lace and everything looks really good. If you want to go back and bleach the knots on this, definitely I would recommend it. However, just using the tinted lace, I mean, it works just as good. But if you don't like it, definitely you can bleach the knots or use whatever product you feel like will help to hide those knots. going to cut some edges here just so this area won't be so long. Now you don't have to add any type of gel or hair mousse to lay it down. You can just kind of create that area so that it blends in pretty good. You can also curl it if you want to. Going to, well I may, just bend it a little bit. Just leave that there. As far as the hair, the hair is a straight texture so you can kind of do whatever you want with it. Um, you can straighten it out. I'm going to leave it straight for today because I think it's really pretty. So with the curler, you can just take the edges and bend them. And you can even cut them a little bit shorter if you feel like they're too long. This hair straight out the box is really easy to deal with. You really don't need to do much to it. And with straight styles, they get you through your week. And with this cap, as you can see, the sides are laying down pretty good just because of that little tab they put in there. I like this style. It's simple. Okay, this is, um, again, this is, what is this, a 18 inch stops right here. Super gorgeous. And as you can see, it does lay flat in the back. Here is pretty. It's not really much I can say. I like the way the cap fit. The cap is actually really good. The parting looks good. The only thing I, I had a problem with is the knots at the front hairline. I felt like they could do a little bit better with forming them there. But for the most part, the hair is gorgeous. The cap actually fits really well. I feel like I can even take this and kind of pull it back. Look how flat that is into a ponytail. And it looks so good. The density is about 150. This is a 
really it's not too lightweight it's just enough where it's not going to be overwhelming for anyone that doesn't like too much hair but yeah I like it it turned out pretty good and of course again this is still glueless so you can see there's no glue there and you don't need it really with this style you can just go glueless as you can see just put it on and go <laughs> But yeah, I will have this wig linked below in the description box for you guys. And I will also put the specs down there for you. Again, this is the 18 inch number two color. And this is their fitted cap, delicate hairline. 